All right, chest day, just only chest, because the way that I'm um, chopping it up right now with my split, it kind of worked out that way where I, ideally I should probably only hit chest today. So you're just going to see six or seven working sets of chest. I'm going to do two sets like usual on bench, and then I'm going to move to some sort of like pressing like lever machine and then I'm gonna do some chest flies. So I'm gonna get warmed up here for bench like usual. Like always guys, make sure you're always focusing on uh, um, warming up your rotator cuffs because your rotator cuffs are really important in your shoulder so, and you don't want those to get injured. And this is definitely the most important body part to get to get warmed up I would say before chest that way you're not having any shoulder problems obviously your chest too but the biggest one being your shoulders because they're the most susceptible to injury so get those in get some rear delt flies in just get everything nice and warm some lateral raises and then by that time, you should be good. So I'm just going to start with the bar here. All right, now I'm gonna start throwing some weight on. Now I'm live. <clears throat> All right, I got 275 in the bar. I'm looking to hit this for two sets of four, so. I don't know, I kind of felt funny in my warm up, so we'll see if I can get it for four here. All right. Yeah, lift off. All right, not bad. All right, that last set was a little bit shaky, so I'm gonna try to focus on cleaning up my form right here. <clears throat> but I'm still gonna leave 275 in the bar because I still wanna push myself simultaneously. So you kinda always wanna walk that fine line between pushing yourself, but also like not hurting yourself, if that makes any sense. All right, here we go. All right. All right, not bad. What's that? No, it it's all good. All right, I got three reps there. I'm not too mad about it. I felt like my form felt better, but you know, just got to keep improving. Now we're going to move on to this machine behind me, which is just like one of those machines where you those levers and you plate load them. All right, change of plans here. I'm going to do probably like three pause reps at 275. And just focus on my form and feeling good. Practice that uh, that fluidity and like my in my bench arc or whatever you want to call it, bit my bench path, I guess I should say. And just make sure everything's feeling fluid because that 275. I mean, I got it for four, but the form just wasn't the best. All right. So three pause reps is probably what I'm going for. Just three 
solid form. This bench is really slippery though. That's the only thing because I just took the yoga mat off. But that just means I'm going to have to be really careful here. All right, here we go. That felt pretty good. So now we're going to move on to that other machine. Oh, this feels really getting nice, honestly. Oh, my chest is already feeling it pretty bad right now. Like, like I've said before to you guys, it does not take much to get the chest really fatigued. So. That's the reason why I'm only doing I'm only gonna do two sets right here. I'm gonna do two sets right here and then I'm gonna move to cable flies. And I might only do two sets of cable flies too. So well I think it'll have to be peck deck actually. Because I don't think they have two cables in here. That's not that big of a deal though. That's not what I'm worried about, so I don't know if I'm going to hit this for a working set or not. It depends on how it feels. So, let's see how it feels real quick. I want to put some. So, the only thing I don't like about these chest press type machines, like with the levers and plate load, is that they start so far back where it's like uncomfortable to like get it out. You see a lot of guys put clips in here, but we don't really have anything in this gym. It's good for like putting in this space right here to give you that extra little like three or four inches forward so you can push it out comfortably instead of push it, pushing it out from like a way deep in your rep like way deep in your rep like this. I don't know how else I should say it, but it just feels really uncomfortable unracking it, but I'm just gonna have to deal with it for now. So let's just try this this weight out. <laughs> Yeah, definitely only going to need one more set of those. That's for sure. 25 or whatever you want to call it. Two plates on each side, like I said before. Because I am already fatigued as shit. Here we go. Peck deck. All right, I've resorted to these single arm cable fly type things because the peck deck upstairs is kind of shitty, unfortunately. So there's a reason to not like this gym. Do one more set of those and I'll be done. All right, last set of these. It's only seven. That's it. 
All right, just finished up the lift and got home. Sorry, I didn't do a pump check again, guys, because uh, I don't really have a place in that gym to do a pump check. But yeah, so the next video is going to be legs. So be expecting a leg day video. And like I said, probably some shoulders too. So peace out, guys.